Hi, I'm Brandon Sweeney here with Ascentium, and today we're going to give an overview of our PCTG 3D printer filament. So what is PCTG? Everyone is familiar with the polyester PET, which stands for polyethylene terephthalate. It's the polymer used to make plastic Coke bottles. Polyesters are popular engineering materials because they have excellent properties at a low price point. In 3D printing, PET is commonly modified to be amorphous by making the copolymer PETG. PCTG, which stands for glycol modified polycyclohexylene dimethylene terephthalate, is very similar to PETG, but has some interesting properties that make it stand out as a higher performance engineering grade resin. So how does it compare? PCTG prints as easy as PLA, it has better toughness than ABS, and can be made crystal clear. It is so tough, in fact, that it has better impact resistance than polycarbonate, which is what bulletproof glass is made from. Here we see a side-by-side -side comparison of a notched IZOD impact test. On the right, we have PCTG. On the left, we have PETG. The results are pretty impressive. The PCTG results in a no-break condition, which is the upper limit for the IZOD test, while the PETG fractures. In addition to outstanding impact resistance, PCTG has a well-balanced set of mechanical properties for entry-level engineering applications. It has a glass transition temperature of 76 degrees Celsius, a tensile strength of up to 46 megapascals, and a modulus of 1.3 gigapascals. In its amorphous state, it has a heat deflection temperature of 62 degrees Celsius, but that can be greatly improved with annealing. Annealing in the polymers industry is a process that relieves internal stresses in materials and increases thermomechanical properties by increasing crystallinity. So what can you print with PCTG? Pretty much anything you would normally print with PLA or ABS. We've seen use cases for medical devices like prosthetics, the optical clarity is excellent for this application and it helps with patient fitment. Jigs and fixtures are another great application for PCTG. PCTG has a huge processing window, but we typically use a nozzle temperature of 250 to 270 degrees Celsius. PCTG is not as moisture sensitive as polyamide or TPU, but we still recommend drying PCTG before use and then transferring it to a sealed container with desiccant during the print. We offer PCTG filament in clear, a variety of standard colors, and an ESD grade with our Ascentium PCTG-Z. In part two, we'll talk a little bit more about the crystallization behavior of PCTG and its chemical properties. And if you'd like to learn more about our materials, you can go to our website, ascentium3d.com materials.